As we prepare for a big snow event, it's crucial to know how to prepare your car for the winter. KX News' Lauren Davis talked to a mechanic about what you can do to start getting your cars and trucks ready for the worst of winter. Winter officially begins in a little over a month, so it's important to make sure you prepare your car before it gets even colder. It's never a bad idea to stay on top of your brake pads. That's, that should be normal maintenance, um, especially your ABS system for icy roads and stuff. You're going to want that working you know, top notch. Another thing to do in the winter is checking your car's battery. Make sure your connections are clean and make sure your battery has enough cold cranking amps. Just because it says 12 volts doesn't mean it's going to have 12 volts when it's 20 below zero outside. Goff said it's not a bad idea to check your oil and antifreeze levels. Make sure you have windshield wiper fluid and it's a safe option to have a car tune up. Something that you may consider getting is an engine block heater. This is very useful for those cold winter days. You should also make sure the tread in your tires is not worn. Tires with low tread could put you at risk for getting into a car crash. And while snow tires do make it easier to drive in the winter, they're recommended but not necessary. Another good option is a good all season tire. Each manufacturer tires has a different spec for tread life, um, a certain 30 seconds. Um, the biggest thing, make sure you have a decent tire for winter that's going to have some sight being a soft rubber compound. If you have a problem with your car's heater, Goff says the best time to fix it is now, since the temperature is continuing to go down. For KX News, I'm Lauren Davis. Goff says around this time of year, customers are coming to him for coolant leaks, car thermostats not working, and battery issues. You should also carry a snow shovel, an ice scraper, cat litter, and a portable phone charger. Keep that phone juiced up when you're driving in case anything happens.